Trigonometric identities. It's a thinking problem T7. Express 8 cos to the power of 4x in the form of a cos 4x plus b cos 2x plus c. State the values of a, b and c. Well, since we have to convert into cos 2x form, let's again look into the formula of cos 2x, right? Let me write it down here for you. So we know cos 2x is equal to 2 cos square x minus 1. And no, we can rewrite this in a different way. We can write what 2 cos square x is, right? So we'll bring both this side and we say, can say cos 2x plus 1 is equal to 2 cos square x, correct? So we'll use this identity to prove our, to find our expression, okay? So what we are given here is 8 cos to the power of 4x, correct? Now what we can do is, we know 2 cos square x is cos 2x plus 1. So, so what we can do is, we can write this as equal to 2 cos square x whole square. Now 2 cos square x whole square gives us 4 times cos to the power of 4x, but we have 8 here. So let me write 2 outside, correct? So that becomes equivalent to 8 cos to the power of 4x, right? Now, so we can now write 2 cos square x as cos 2x plus 1. So let's do that. So we get 2 times. So instead of 2 cos square x, I'm going to write cos 2x plus 1 whole square, correct? Now we can expand this. If we do that, we get a square plus 2ab plus b square. So a square is cos square 2x plus 2 times cos 2x plus 1. Correct? So we have a form which is quite similar to this. We at least got the last two terms. But here we have cos 2x. Now again we will use the same. 2 cos square x. So we'll, we'll get 2 like this. We'll open the bracket and we get 2 cos square 2x plus 4 cos 2x plus 2, correct? Now, 2 cos square x can be written as cos 2x. It's 2x, it becomes 4. Do you see that? So, so this could be now written as cos of 4x plus 1 plus 4 cos 2x plus 2, right? So how did we do that? We simply wrote, replaced x with 2x, right? So this becomes cos of 4x plus 1 equals to 2 cos square of 2x. Do you see that? Replacing x with 2x. And that's what we got here. Do you see that? Now we can combine the like terms, 1 and 2. So we get cos of 4x plus 4 cos 2x plus 3. Now if you compare this equation with the given one, which is this, we can say that a is equal to 1, b is equal to 4, and c is equal to 3. And that's the solution for the given problem. Thank you.